Mr. Pryor's office. Yes, ma'am. This is Lynn Carter in Fort Smith, Arkansas. How are you doing, Mr. Carter? I'm not having a very good day today. I'm My sorry. Parkinson's is acting up and other health issues. I was going to ask you. I called the other day and someone was going to send me, some lady said they were going to send me the formal apology that I that you received from the VA that they apologize for my abuse of, of uh, June the 15th of 2011 and the letter of inquiry. Has it been sent, ma'am? I will be happy to check and see. And can you repeat your name one more time? Lynn, L-Y-N-N, initial E, Carter, C-A-R-T-E-R. Okay, and this was your um, the letter of apology? Yes, it was for a letter of apology from the VA office in uh, the VA in hospital in Fayetteville, and also the letter of uh, of uh, um, um, I'm sorry, I'm not having a good day today. I uh, it's a letter of inquiry that I also asked for, please, ma'am. Okay. Well, I will. Um Go check and see right when we get off the phone, and if not, I will have it on its way. Okay, because I sent a letter uh, Tuesday, I believe it was, asking for it. Mm -hmm. And she said she would send it that day on Tuesday. Okay. Okay. Well, I will go check with them. Is there some way I could check that you could call for me to check? Can you put uh, me through to them? Yes, hold on one moment. Thank you very much, ma'am. Can we help you, Mr. Carter? Yes, ma'am. Uh, I sent a letter. Uh, my wife sent a letter on Tuesday, I believe it was. We got it. Did you get it? Yes. Are you able to send those documents, please, ma'am? We don't have. I mean, we don't have anything but what we've sent you already. We don't have a letter of apology. We don't have an inquiry. We don't have anything to send you. You don't have a letter of inquiry. We have already provided you everything we can, sir. What do you send your, your case has been closed for some time, so we don't have access to the physical file anymore. No, ma'am, the case hasn't been closed no, yet. Sir, with our office, it has been. When we Why, ma'am? When we sent your final letter, we closed it out. Why did you do that? Because we're finished with it. We've done everything that we're able to do. But I asked for an investigation, ma'am. Okay, Mr. Carter, I mean, we can do this over and over every day if you'd like to, but we have done everything possible from our office. I don't see how. And Mark hasn't called me, and that Robbie Reed was rude and hung up on me the other day, or a couple of months ago, it was. Okay. Can you tell me why? Mr. Carter, we've done everything we can from our office. Everything? You said everything? Yes, sir. You know I'm recording this, don't you, ma'am? Okay. Okay. Well, you could have Mark call me. He could at least call me. I am a constituent. And that Robbie Reed could return my phone calls also. Many phone calls I've made to him. Can you explain why that? No, why did, sir. And he told me to not call back. He screamed at me not to call back. Okay. And I, I asked for an explanation on that. I asked Mark for an explanation on that. He could at least call me. Is he, doesn't he have the balls to do that? As a politician with his constituents, don't he return his phone calls? Hello? Yes, sir, I'm listening to you, sir. Doesn't he call, make his, return his calls to his constituents? And I'd like to know why he didn't order an investigation. Okay, we, we don't do investigations, sir. We, we've done everything. What about all the years that I, ma'am, that I have been asking for help and getting my VA benefits. Mr. Carter, we provided you the help that we could. You didn't do anything. Okay, well, 12 years to now. That way, but we've done everything. Or so. This is appalling. This is a, a blow. That someone is representing me, representing me in Washington, D.C., a cripple man, a veteran, and I can't receive help. It's beyond belief. Can you answer that? Mr. Carter, we've done everything we can for you. Until you have something new, you know, that you put in, then we can look into it again. But we've done everything that you've asked us to do so far. Ma'am, I've asked, uh, I've asked 
for the letter of inquiry from the VA hospital, which you could get from the VA hospital. I've asked for an investigation, which the top dogs in Washington, D.C., from the president down, tell me that I have to go through representatives from District 3 here in Arkansas. Mark Pryor is a representative of District 3 here in Arkansas. Now, why can't he get me an investigation, ma'am? We've done everything we can, Mr. Carter. Thank you.